Hey guys, Tech Manager with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to fix your iPhone if you're not receiving verification code from apps when you're requesting verification code. Maybe it's TikTok, maybe another social media app where you're trying to use your phone number, right, to get a specific code, but it just simply isn't coming through. What can you do to fix that problem? We're going to show you just what to do. So first thing is, pull on the control menu here and you want to ensure that your phone is not on do not disturb if you have any of the focus settings even right it's going to interfere with sms coming through for things like the verification code go ahead and turn that off you can also go into your setting of your iphone and under focus mode ensure that there is no other focus mode turned on because again that will block your code from coming through the next thing you want to do is Go ahead and pull on the control menu here, put your phone on airplane mode briefly, and then turn it back off. And it does a quick network refresh of things like your cellular service and Wi-Fi. So if you're having issues with the connectivity, it will fix it for you. Now, the next thing you want to do after that is ensure that you have the proper cellular signal, which I'll show you on this phone, where, as you can see here, I have Verizon here. The bars are kind of low here, so when that does happen, you may not get messages right away. So I recommend moving to another area that you can move to so that you can more bars and potentially better sell your service there, and that might help as well. Now, after you've done that and you know you have good uh, cellular signal and it's not that, the next thing you want to do is go ahead and open up your messages app. And if you had previous verification code specifically from that app or that program that you're trying to do go ahead and delete the previous one by simply swiping to the right and click on delete and then you're going to go ahead and uh, delete that so that the previous verification is gone so it doesn't get confused when a new one comes in so you want to remove that now after you have done that the next thing to do is go into your setting of your iphone this time in the setting of your iphone you're going to want to go to the phone app here and verify the phone number right here is the same number that you're trying to use for your verification code. Of course, if this is a different number, of course your verification isn't gonna come through. You can also click on this number to edit it, but it should be the same number that your carrier gave you on that's on your eSIM or regular SIM card. Now, after that, the next setting you wanna check in your settings here under messages here. First thing is you wanna ensure iMessage is turned on. If not, you can go turn it on and off which will help along with that other things to take a note here is you now you want to make sure that send as SMS is turned on and then along with that MMS messaging is turned on finally one area that's important here is where this message filtering comes in play this should be turned off by default but for some reason you have this turned on that means messages that are coming from unknown number will get filtered or block and you won't be able to see them so turn that setting off so it doesn't block any of that now after you have done that and you're still not getting any verification code it's time to do a force restart on your iphone in order to do that you're going to press and release the volume up followed by press and release the volume down and then finally hold the side button until the screen goes completely black and once you see the apple logo appear you'll let go of that button so i'll do volume up volume down Finally, I hold the side button just like that until the screen goes completely black. You do not need to slide to power off because that will be a normal shutdown. So I'm going to wait till the phone completely shuts down. And once I see the Apple logo, I love to go up that button. Again, make sure it's volume up followed by volume down quick. And if Siri activates that you didn't press volume up and down quick enough. Now this method we're doing is shutting down the phone, reloading the code, and this method will not delete any of your personal data. So all of your photos, videos, apps will be safe on your phone. You do not have to worry about that. Now, after you have done all of that, of course, go back to the app that you're looking to get the verification code again. Try again to see if you get the verification code to come through again. Now, after you have tried that and it's still not working, what you want to do is go into your setting of your iPhone. This time you're going to go to general, go all the way down here, it says transfer reset iPhone. You're going to click on reset and you want to do a network reset. When you do a network reset, which takes about a minute or two, it will erase things like saved Wi-Fi password and also refresh your network setting for your carrier. So if you're having issues with the network connectivity on your carrier side, 
it will fix it for you. This method will not delete any of your personal data, so all of your photos, videos, and apps will be safe. And finally, if you did all of that and you simply still can't get the verification code, two things to do. First thing is contact your carrier and let them know you're not getting text verification code. Sometimes they can also be blocking it on their end, or they might need to do a refresh on your phone line. So contact them. Along with that, also contact maybe the support for the app. So if it's a so social media app, you can always find the contact information somewhere or any of that and see if they're also blocking maybe your phone from getting those verification code. But that's it for this video. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure that like and subscribe button. And also, if you found a better way to fix text verification code not coming through, leave it in the comment section. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.